Hi, my name is Matthew Pierce. I'm a software engineer, and today I'm going to show you how to add a program to the startup menu in Windows. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to find the program that you want to add. So go to your computer and locate it. I've got mine conveniently located here in Eclipse. I'm going to, I'm going to want to start Eclipse, say, uh, with startup. Say it's, it's, a, it's my favorite editor, and when I reboot Windows, I want to have it come up and bring Eclipse up. So you want to find it, and then right-click on it, say Copy, and then you want to go to your Start menu and go to All Programs and find that Start directory right down there. See it right there? Right-click on that, say Open. And right in there, you can see I've already got a couple things. I've got Dropbox and Magic Disk that comes up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a Paste Shortcut from the Eclipse that I just brought up or that I copied before, um, taken, you know, you can give it a more convenient name or something like that. And now when my Windows box reboots, it's going to come up and it will automatically start Eclipse for me. Now, you may have some parameters or something that you want to have added to it. So say you want it to come up and open up um, maybe a, a text file that you're working on. What you can do, depending upon what the program is, you have uh, some parameters you can tweak. So go to the properties, and right here you can see where it says target. It is showing the uh, Eclipse where it lives on my machine. And I can just right there, I can you know, add a text file, say, that I want it to open. I can say my, my text dot txt something like that so if you had a file to open up you could do it that way but you know that that goes for uh, pretty much any program that you're going to want to put into the start menu you can update the parameters and give it the certain parameters that you uh, need to do to have it come up in the configuration that you like so i'm matt pierce today we talked about how to put a start or a, a program into your startup directory in windows thanks for watching